We are in the night sky, which is actually personally one of my favorite cars because you get to see everything along the way. There's no solid roof to you know keep you from looking at all the tall mountains that we see, especially along the last half an hour to Silverton. A lot of things are above us aside from the river. First class cars, you get several things that the uh, coach class cars do not, including a person like me, like an attendant that will, we actually go along and point things out along the way, all the photo opportunities, as well as some of the history, get to ask us questions, and then we also walk through and get you all the drinks. A full bar as well as non-alcoholic beverages, so you get everything as well as this amazing view. On only first class cars, you can actually go outside and take pictures. So you can actually get outside, get more um, into the views, and take pictures without the obstructions. The neat thing about the seats in this car is they actually can face either forward or backwards. So the side with the single seats, you actually get to face the person you're with if you want to, or both can face forward. Same thing actually with the double-sided seats is you can face either direction. So group four, go ahead and face them towards each other. This train is living history because it's to the same specifications it was over 130 years ago. So you've got locomotives that are over 90 years old, cars that are from even back to the 1880s, and you get to see how people traveled in that time as well as be able to see all the views along the way. I feel like people get immersed in that, that history of both Colorado and the railroad from the 1880s.